people fuck up. Most people eat a big portion of food when they go to sleep. What happens? They're not resting. What their body's doing while they're closing their eyes is digesting all. So a lot of people will have a late night snack or they have a large meal before bed. And yes, this makes you sleepy because if you think about it, you have a limited blood supply and digestion is a process that requires a lot of energy and a lot of blood. And so what happens is you see blood flow being redirected from the extremities, the arms and legs and the central nervous system and the brain to the digestive tract. And so now you feel hazy in the brain and you feel lazy in your body. And this makes you tired, but it doesn't support sleep quality for a couple of reasons. Number one, as you know, Mr. Belmar is saying is your body becomes preoccupied with that process and now you can't enter that deep parasympathetic state. You actually need for digestion. I mean, it's just like you're trying to go to sleep and you're trying to digest both those things at the same time. It doesn't make any sense. The other thing is for deep restorative sleep, there's a lot of things that drive sleep quality. You know, there's melatonin accumulation, adenosine, etc. But what actually initiates deep sleep is a declining core body temperature. And when you have a large meal before bed, all that warm blood that goes to the digestive tract and gets your core body temperature high actually keeps you from initiating that deep sleep. So I absolutely agree with Mr. Belmar here. Ideally, you want to avoid eating within three to four hours of bedtime. So you have lower core body temperature and you're in a ketogenic state where you actually also see a shift in something called RQ, respiratory quotient. So when you have enough time between the time that you eat and the time you go to bed and you digest that food, you overcome that postprandial glucose response and you're in a ketogenic state, your breathing rate decreases, and now you're in an even more parasympathetic state. I can go on an entire lecture on this one topic alone, but the simple thing is, when you avoid eating before bed, you're gonna sleep better, be healthier, and live longer. My name's Andres, I'm a physiology neuroscientist. Make sure to follow for more health hacks.